Hey, what's up, guys? So this uh, video will be a quick update on Seller Network. So when I was recording my last video about Seller, I was mentioning that we have to hold this support line right here around 15 cents because this is the most significant support to hold right now. And uh, I think yesterday we've been trading in this range right here, somewhere around 15 to 16 cents. And I was mentioning that if we uh, are starting to close some candles below this support area right here, so that would be somewhere around 14 to 15 cents, we will retest most likely this support area right here um, around 13 cents again. So as you can see, guys, we are currently still trading above the support line around 15 cents right here. And uh, if you also take a look, you can see that since we topped out right here around give me a second guys around uh 20 cents we are currently trading in this downtrend in the four hour time frame so as you can see we are trading in this downtrend channel right now currently and if you also take a look at the volume profile guys you can see that let's switch to the daily time frame so i can show it to you a little bit better so if you take a look at the volume profile guys you can see that the volume is currently decreasing so that means it is very likely that we will see in the next let's say four to eight hours i'm expecting a move to the upside guys to retest this previous top right here again but you never know and that's why i think we should definitely wait out for confirmation to the upside or to the downside and i think if we are start closing a candle below uh, a, if we start closing a, can a candle above the strand line right here so that would be somewhere around 17 to 18 cents then i'm expecting a move to retest this previous top right here again around 90 to 20 cents and if we start closing one or two four hour candles below the support area at 14 or 15 cents, then I'm expecting a sell off to retest this support area right here again around 12 to 13 cents. Because if you take a look at the past price action, you can see that this top right here around 12 to 13 cents was the last uh, very significant support and resistance for seller. And since we broke out from here, we retested this support line right here successfully, as you can see. And that's why I'm telling you guys this is the most uh, significant support in the next days to hold for Seller Network, around 12 to 13 cents. If we cannot hold it, my next demand zone would be somewhere around 10 to 11 cents. And that would be also this four hour uh, trend line right here, this yellow trend line. As you can see, we are trading since uh, for about 22 days now in this uptrend right here. And if we, st uh, and if we, start closing some candles below this support line right here and we cannot hold up around 12 to 13 cents then i'm expecting a sell-off to retest this trend line right here around 10 to 11 cents guys and otherwise like i already said if um we start candles if we start closing some candles above this uh, trend line right here so that would be somewhere around 16 to 17 cents then i'm expecting a retest of this uh, previous double top right here between 19 to 20 cents so yeah guys um for all of you who want to make a long trade in the next hours so i would consider to make a long trade from this support area right here would it take profit target of about 20 cents and a very tight stop loss of about 14 cents and i mean even even if this trade wouldn't work out it would still be a, a good trade in my opinion because as you can see we, we have a lot of uh, support at this area around 15 cents and we are still holding it for about one day right now so in my opinion this is definitely a very good trade to, to take but uh yeah so i would take my trade around 15 cents then i would uh, take out about 50 percent of my position size at this area somewhere around 17 cents if seller is able to bounce from this area right here then i would uh, set my stop loss back at my break even point where i entered my trade around 15 cents uh, just to make sure i have a prof profitable trade and I, I don't make any losses anymore and then of course i would scale out 100 percent of my position size at my take profit target and also this double top right here around 90 to 20 cents so yeah guys this is uh my plan for the next four to eight hours to make maybe a long trade from this support area right here around 15 cents and like i already said watch out for this trend line also because it's very likely that if we start closing some candles above this trend line right here that we will see a retest of this previous top right here otherwise if we start uh, seeing some weakness below the support area 
I'm expecting a sell-off to retest this area right here again around 12 to 13 cents. And we would also have something like a head and shoulders plat uh, pad I'm playing out, guys. So definitely watch out for that. So yeah, guys, uh, that was the quick update for Seller. If you enjoyed the video, please give me a like, guys. Subscribe to my channel. If you have any questions, just comment down below. And I hope I will see you in the next video. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.